<clears throat> Yo, what's going on, YouTube? Terrific here, coming at you with an entirely new project. But the kicker is that while it is another Zelda game, we are joined by someone who I've done stuff with before. Bad introduction. Okay, go, wannabe. Hi, it's me, wannabe reviewer, <laughs> and I'm here on this wild ride. <laughs> this yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah, beautiful intro. Um, oh, I, should I have been reading? Nah, it's fine. We don't need to uh, read. No. The, the viewers can read, man. It's fine. Yeah. All you need to know, if they've ever played Ocarina of Time, guys, uh, we're playing Majora's Mask today, I mean, which should be obvious from the title. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, terrific. I think he's played the game before, like, a quarter of the way. Yeah. He, I've actually beat it quite a few times. And I actually suggested to him, like, hey, what if we play Majora's Mask? Have you ever played that game? I really like that game. And I was like, what if we do kind of like a little playthrough where you're playing it and I'm kind of doing like co-commentary and like I have a guide open or whatever. And he agreed. And so here we are. And yeah, for anyone who's played Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask is the direct sequel to it. This is the same link from Ocarina of Time. And, and basically all it says is that... Uh, he it's it's believed that link is looking for navi because navi at the end of ocarina of time she leaves and so he should be looking for her and that's where the game starts basically and link fell off his horse in a very lame way <laughs> um like the way he falls just looks so anticlimactic it's just like black <laughs> yeah and then <laughs> i mean I've, I've never fallen off a, i've fallen off of a horse before but he just like passes out from it it's like bro what what the you survived worse than this you literally <laughs> Yeah. Um, what was I going to say? So yeah, and if you can't tell, Wannabe Reviewer is a much better YouTuber than I because his introduction for the game was so much more better. Wait, more better? <laughs> Apparently he's better at English too, but his introduction <laughs> was fantastic. A lot better than what I could have said. And if you're looking, um, uh, you can tell that the graphics are kind of blocky. And that's because we're going back to the original Nintendo 64 one. And the reason is because it's a classic and totally not because my computer is a potato and can't handle the remastered one. So let's just dive right in. Uh, yeah, 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 you broke it. No way. You can't touch it. Ah, uh, but okay, let's just... Yeah, so basically they're all wanting to play Ocarina. Yeah. But Skull Kid's hogging it to himself. Yeah. And Skull Kid already has the titular Majora's Mask, which yeah. we'll kind of find out how he came to possession of it. Yeah. Well, I mean, technically we don't know it's the Majora's Mask. So what? What are you? What are you talking about, wannabe? They. We. For all I mean, we know, that's his face. On, it's literally on the title screen. <laughs> um. You know what? <laughs> I don't need this right now. I've had a long day. I've been in a lab. And for some reason, when you work in a lab, people think that you're like the maintenance guy because we had a lot That's of people <laughs> like calling down. Like one woman called asking for printer ink. And we had okay. to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You're like busy doing research or something, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, like we were running samples and the woman calls on the phone like, hey, um, my printer's out of ink up here. <laughs> and uh, Station C, I was like, um, what? And then, you know, yeah. since I'm still new, uh, another guy picked up. What am I doing? I don't need that. Another guy picked no, up. No, you do. You need all that money. Oh, no, wait, no, we do? Okay, okay, oh, okay. <laughs> well, thank important. you. <laughs> You well, all the money you can get. well, this is why I want to be reviewers here, because if you guys remember from my Twilight Princess um, playthrough, uh, I suck at Zelda a lot more than what I thought I did, and I would have to look at guides and darn near every single episode. But since he's played this game multiple times, he knows what he's doing. He can keep me on track. Um, <clears throat> yeah, like legit, I don't even need a guide. Oh, what the like heck? The first for like the first like bit, you'll, you'll, I'll, I'll tell you when I open the guide, when I finally open the guide up. Okay. Like, for like the first bit, I've actually memorized like, exactly like a good way to do this stuff. It's actually really funny. Oh, nice. Not Wait, to show off how do I? Like, humble brag. <laughs> yeah, humble bragging. Um, how do I move the? Can I not move the camera in this game? I don't think you can. From what I remember, I don't. Think okay. You can. Unless uh, it's like a directional <clears throat> pad, but I don't think so. And it's it's old school game, you know. Yeah. As the link just falls. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, freaking That's Lincoln. funny. Yeah. Um, yeah, but... I was going to say, Frank was going to play Ocarina of Time, but hasn't played this game. Interesting little fact, but when Link jumps, he's doing the little, like, sideways jump that only uh, adult Link can do. That's what Ooh. shows you that this is adult Link that's been sent back in time, so he still has those skills. Oh, that's nice. Watching my trivia is totally wrong, and I was like, I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> I swear I've never played Red before. Uh, what's with that stupid horse of yours? It doesn't listen to a word that's said to it. Well, it listens to me, dum dum. There's no point in riding a thing. <laughs> uh, never mind. So I did you a favor and got rid of it. Oh, boo hoo. Why the sad face? I just thought that I'd have some fun with you. Oh, come now. Do you really think that you can beat me? Oh, wait, that was fast. I didn't. Yeah, just said you can beat me as I am now. <laughs> okay. Fool. Okay. There we go. <laughs> but, uh, oh, yeah. But I guess back to my story. Um, but, yeah, a woman calls down for printer ink, and a guy just takes it up to her, so I guess it happens on a regular basis <laughs> that people just call down yeah. to the lab for stuff. Yeah, I have no idea why. But hey, why not put the ink somewhere that's more easily accessible for everybody? Yeah, I don't know. I, your guess is as good as mine, but I did find something out because uh, my wife is friends with the nurse who works there. And the nurse was talking to like my uh, supervisor um, in the lab. And he said that if he had a job for me, he would have hired me on the spot. So that's really nice. Um, oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, now we... Yes, we got the iconic, um, what, what's this again? Deku uh, Scrub. There we go. Yes, Deku Scrub Link. Yeah, <laughs> so basically Link has been turned into a Deku Scrub. Uh, basically Skull Kid, like, cursed him. And so that's what he looks <clears> like now. I mean, I think it's, <laughs> I mean, I think it's a pretty good look. I like it. I think the Deku Scrub look is actually pretty cool. But, yeah. Um, they're, you'll, you'll kind of see. They're actually kind of looked down upon a little bit. The Oof. Yeah, you'll see right now. <laughs> so she got left behind. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, Skull Kid. Wait for me. I'm here. Te How do you pronounce this? Tell? Yeah, Tell. Tell? Her okay. Her a pun. She's, uh, she's Tattle and her brother's Tail. <laughs> That's hilarious. Wait, you mean the opposite? So she, so, so she was just beating him up, and now she's like, yeah. you. <laughs> if I wasn't dealing with you, I wouldn't have got... It, I didn't tell you to beat me up. What do you mean? <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Was there something stuck on my face? Where is your face? Will you stop staring at me and just... How do I... Oh, I don't... Oh, please, <laughs> yeah. Help me help this little girl out. <laughs> oh, tell. I wonder if that child would be all right on his own. Ooh. So that's the thing. Um, even, though they never show, you know, even though the fairies are always just little balls of light, I think it's implied that they do look like actual like little huh. miniature people. You know what I mean? Yeah. Dude, call me call me ballerina Link, cause I I am doing a wonderful job here. Uh, hold up, I got this. Uh oh. Uh. Um. There, there we go. go. There you go. Oh, oops. Alright, where are you launching yourself? Ha ha! Wait. That wasn't it? Okay, hold up. What hold are you up. trying to do? <laughs> um, I don't know. You don't have to use this. I mean, it's just oh, a I don't? skill, but you don't need it. Oh. No. <laughs> What's he trying to do? There's no specific he wants to like, I do. Thought, like, just waiting. I thought. Wait. No, no, just open the damn door. Just open the door. I can't open the door. It won't. Oh. Yes, you can. Okay. <laughs> I thought I. I thought it was a puzzle. I thought it was like the first no, puzzle of the game. It's, no, it's just you can. It... Oh. Don't leave me behind. I don't even like you. That stuff. I. No, I that's okay. Stuff I yeah. That's... Yeah. I was, I was just beating you in the face, yeah. but yeah. I. Forgive me, please. You want to know what that? Da, da, da. Well, I just happen to have an idea of where he might be going. Take me with you and I'll help you out. Deal? Please? I guess. Good. So then it's... I mean, she's not as good as Midna, but I guess it'll work. My name yeah, is Tattle. Midna, Midna's, yeah, Midna's like top tier, man. Yeah, she is. <laughs> so it's nice to meet you or whatever. Oh, now speaking that, of which, I, I, I like how you <clears throat> play through. 
like later on you were like super like annoyed every time it would even pop up though. <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah like, she would pop up to say something and you would be like shut up <laughs> Well, I mean, I, look, at first it was kind of cute, you know, ha ha ha, she's a little imp thing, but then she just got annoying, and then she would, and then I would accidentally hit the button to summon her, and then, uh, it's just a mess. Yeah. Alright, oh. so you're gonna head to your left. Yeah, of course. There's a chest all down there. Oh. So dive in there. Okay. I'm trying to, okay, wait, wait, there we go. Yeah, so you're gonna get that chest. Yeah. And before we go through the door. I mean, there maybe, maybe I want to get to the chest after we get to the door. Nope. A Deku nut. Press B while flying and drop a Deku bomb. Upon impact, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. There we go. Wait, I think I'm starting to realize that I don't need to be directly over it in order to, like, dive yeah. into it. Yeah, so just follow these to the door, obviously. Yeah. Da 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 da. Oh. Oh, oh. 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 What'd you do? What'd you do? Ha. You made it. You made it. <laughs> just you made don't. it. Press Z and talk to me, I guess. That's not Z. You have to be. Yeah. You can just get closer, honestly. Wait. It's fine. Crap, which one is Z? What did I map Z oh, to? No. That's not Z. Oh cool. Uh, I for I think I forgot to map just, Z to just something. Get, just get, just yeah, get closer, it's, okay. <laughs> it's okay. And also, I don't know why, but I think I'm losing my voice, so I won't be able to oh, be. Really? Yeah, I won't be as like energetic, which is very unfortunate. Okay, this is important. This is important. <laughs> okay, it's, it's strange, but the way you look right now sort of looks like this tree. It looks like all dark. It looks all dark and gloomy. Almost like it could start crying in any second now. How sad. But mm. That's kind of important to keep in mind. Because okay. It's never really brought up again. But if you remember it, you can kind of be like, "Oh." So just just keep it in mind. Okay. So we're all you people. Crazy windy uh, <clears throat> tunnel. And what were you gonna say? Oh, I was gonna say, yeah, all you people get your notebooks out so that you can um jot this all down. The lore. Yeah. There's going to be a quiz on this at the end of the video, just so you know. And I swear, if you cheat and rewind the video, I will know. And I will be heavily disappointed. Where am I going? Just, just go through the bridge, man. <laughs> yeah, Terrific said that whoever uh, gets first place in his quiz, they get $1,000. So uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I will personally deliver the $1,000 that Wannabe gives me. You, oh, <laughs> you met with a terrible so fate, haven't you? Is super creepy, man. Yeah, he like, is. He's, she's scared. She's scared. He's super creepy, dude. I own the Happy Mask Shop. I travel far and wide in search of masks. During my travels, a very important mask was stolen from me by an imp in the woods. Minna? So here I am, <laughs> at a loss, and now I found you. Now, don't think me rude, but I have been following you. Would you like some candy? <laughs> <laughs> For I know of a way to return you to your former self. If you can get back the precious item that was stolen... F wait, if you can get back the precious Is item... <laughs> <laughs> that was stolen from you. I will return you to normal. Just return me now. In exchange, all I ask is that you get back my precious mask from that imp that stole it from me. I butchered that sentence. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? Is it not a simple task? Why, to someone like you, it should by no means be a difficult task. Except... The one thing is, I'm a very busy fellow, and I must leave this place in three days. How grateful I would be if you could bring it back to me before my time here is up. But yes, you'll be fine. I see you are young and have tremendous thighs. I'm sure... Oh, <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I'm sure you'll find it right away. Well then, I'm counting on you. Why is there emphasis on counting? <laughs> I don't know, to be more ominous. It was, like, it was a highlight. Of it, but okay. 
the first day, 72 hours remaining. Ooh, South that Clock Town. That's aesthetic, or it tells you like how much time you have left. I love that mm -hmm. aesthetic. I think it's so cool. Yeah, and it's also kind of ominous too, because what I do remember is like, you know, playing through a little... Um, I played through like the first dungeon and like I thought I was getting the hang of it and then all of a sudden day three <laughs> like oh yeah exactly <laughs> he gives me the creeps that mask salesman was the sorry just thinking out loud but three days even if we never sleep that still leaves us with a measly 72 hours talk about demanding we don't just stand there we're going to see the great fairy Look, you want to find the Skull Kid, don't you? The Great Fairy would know what he's up to. She watches over everything. She sure wasn't watching over me. And just between <laughs> you and me, the Skull Kid is no match for the Great Fairy. Go to the shrine near the North Gate. You'll find the Great Fairy in there. All right. All right. So ignore what she just, ignore what she just said and go up those stairs. That guy's coming down. No, 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 no. Up those stairs. Yeah, up there. Okay. I love the sound effect I, I make. Know, like, ignore <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what she just said. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, it's right there. Uh, there's a piece of fairy right there. Grab it. Wait, jump what? Put it in the water. Oh, okay. Look, the fairy. It's, it's that yellow, yellow thing. Just huh? jump and get it. Jump. There you go. Perfect. Uh, the mask old kid has broken me apart and scattered my pieces. Please find a way to return me. Oh, okay. Yeah, so she would have just sent you here. So that's why I okay. saved you some time. And oh, nice. Like... Whoa, what are you doing, Speedy? Um, but yeah, that was nice. <laughs> Yeah, I like Harmless. Yeah, just, just ignore what you said. Just, just forget it. Okay, so go behind the clock tower, basically. Uh, don't touch that yellow flower. Do not touch the yellow flower. Yeah, hey. don't touch it. Okay, fine, Same. fine. Re time on some on a cutscene. But no, 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 um, the other way. Wait, other I can't... Way. This way? Oh, yeah, this way. Yes, up, up those stairs. Okay. Well, Keep actually, going, wanted to reviewer, up, 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 up. I think this would technically be a ramp and not stairs, but, you know. Uh, yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> right there, right there, right there. No, what? No, that, blue, that blue doorway to your right. What? Oh, there. okay. Right there. There, there we go. You go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ooh, is that Tingle? Yeah. Wait, is that his name? Yes. <laughs> Tingle's so annoying. I'm, I mean, that means I can do another Creeper voice. Oh, oh God. <laughs> okay, let's see what I've got. <clears throat> Ooh, what's this? Green clothes, white fairy. Sir, could you by chance be a forest fairy? Oh, my. My name is Tangle, and you'll find out why. I I think I am the same as you, sir, a forest fairy. Alas, though, I am already age 35. Age ain't nothing but a number with me. No fairy has come to meet me yet. My father tells me to grow up and act my age, but why? I love acting like a little boy. I tell you, <laughs> Tingle is the very reincarnation of a fairy. Now, while I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own, I sell maps to help out my father. Lucky, lucky. You're so lucky to have a fairy. I know, I know. We should become friends and you can sleep over in my house. Yes, yes. In exchange, I will sell you a map for cheap as a sign of my friendship. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Um, no. <laughs> okay. No. no. <laughs> I yeah, see. Is well, call again. Tingle, tingle. Ooh, Kula Limpa. <laughs> These are the magic words that Tingle created himself. It really gets my tingle going. Don't steal them. <laughs> oh my God. Anyways, go back, go in there. Wait, uh, where no, am I going? You're facing the right way. Okay. No, you're facing the right way earlier. Oh. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm going back. <laughs> Oh, Look! Oh <laughs> Look! I'm getting no, the way you were facing before. Right here. Uh, uh, no, other way, other way, other way. Uh, 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 that way. Okay. Yes. Up Look, there, what? Up there. What can I say, for man? Tingle. You were it, for a moment, you were facing it, and then you just like totally went. <laughs> All right. Oh, cool. Oh no, the great fairy. And then you put the fairy back together. Ooh. And it's, it's, it's this fairy that's basically like, ada, ada, Link Coon. <laughs> <laughs> ha, Tattle. And you, 
Young strapping altered shape, thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. I am the great fairy of magic. I thought that masked kid was helping me, but I grew careless. All I can offer you is this. I shall grant you magic power as a sign of my gratitude. Please accept it. And then I'll show you so some more like, gratitude. I feel, like, I, feel like, I, feel like, I feel like her voice doesn't fit her appearance. I feel like she looks really old, honestly. <laughs> I mean, you know what? So she might be a cougar, I, but I, nothing I, wrong I, with that. I, I think it's the, I think it's the makeup. I think it makes her look like she's like, yeah, like a fifty year old cougar, <laughs> but the voice sounds like she's like a twenty year old young woman. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Well, I mean, hey, that's bit, you know? look that that's how the cougars get you. They make you think that they're young, but they're. Let me stop. <laughs> You've been granted magic power. Okay, yeah, I can shoot a bubble. Your magic power decreases when you shoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That man who lives in the observatory outside the town may know of the Skull Kid's whereabouts, but be careful, darling. I need you alive in one piece. You must not underestimate the child's powers, kind one. If you ever are returned to your former shape, come see me after hours. I think she even says I'll give you more help. Yes, she oh, will. No. <laughs> Okay, so what you're uh, gonna do now yes. is exit here. Okay. And instead of trying to get to the observatory, they're just gonna block your way. Okay. So what you need to do is pop that balloon. Pop that balloon. <clears throat> oh, okay. Yeah, they'll get closer to it. You're too far. No, not oh too my goodness. Balloon, the, the oh. massive balloon. Whoops. Look, you need to be specific, wannabe. I mean, <laughs> Majora's massive balloon is like times its size, but okay. Perfect. <laughs> <clears throat> this kid was like, what? And I talked to the kid. Yes. Are you the one who just popped that? Wait, popped that up there? Not bad for a Deku scrub. We bombers have a hideout that leads to the observatory outside town. You need a code to get in. Maybe I'll tell you what it is. But don't think that you're getting it that easily. I can't just tell you what the code is. You have to pass my test first. Are you ready? Yeah, why not? All right, line up, guys. Oh, cool. If you can find out five of us by tomorrow morning, I'll teach you the code. Wait, it's already the evening, though. Uh, well, you gotta hurry and find them. Uh... Alright. Well, I'm gonna get going. No, <laughs> just leave the <laughs> no it's easy to watch. Don't leave this area yet. Don't leave this area yet. Uh, okay. One behind the slide. Oh, nice. <clears throat> hey, what up, bro? Ah, oh, you caught me. Now there are only right. four left. Now, now, uh, let's see, the way you're going, yeah, that tree. Whoops, this that, tree. Hold on. Uh, uh, no, that tree across from, there's, there's a kid right next to it, there he is. Wait, he's not even trying to hide. Whoa, okay. It's because they can run, that's why. <laughs> I got this. Where'd you go? Oh, come on. Come on, Terrific, I know you're what? chasing down little boys. <laughs> I was just about to make a joke like that, but you beat me to it. <laughs> All right, I'm assuming that was the only one in that area. Oh yeah, there yeah, goes there was another kid. There was two in that area. There should be two in this <clears throat> area and one in the west area. So. Oh. All right, so there's that's the kid. You can oh, try to brute force it, but it's really but the code is always random every playthrough. Uh, you can totally try to brute force it if you want. Okay. That kid jumps off with the chicken. Whoa, so buddy. Around. I mean, the there we go. Oh, you caught me. Now there's only two left. Um. Yeah, there should. Uh, don't leave this area yet. Oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, there he is. Of... Yeah, I see him. He's on top of the roof. Right? Yeah. I think I can well, go up that. here. Oh. No, no. You have to get that flower. You have to jump in the flower to jump onto the roof. Ah. Yeah, right there. Yeah, you know, I would make a joke about hunting these little boys, but I think that might be a, a new low even for me, though. Oh boy. <laughs> right, get him, get him, get him. Nice. There you go. Oh, you caught me. Boom. Dude, I'm so okay. glad you're here. This would have taken me forever. <laughs> Alright, so now get, get down. I don't know where you're going. <laughs> um. Yeah. Just keep going straight. Oh, no, okay. No, no, no. no. Alright. There's an exit to the right, right here. There you okay. go. So follow the steps. Perfect. Okay, now you're gonna run straight across. Okay. Just straight across. Huh? To the other. A little bit to the right. To that entrance right there. Okay. That entrance right there. Nice. And there's gonna be one kid on, there's gonna be one <clears> kid on this <throat> side. Okay, not bad. 
And then that guy right there, the one that you started kind of jumping around a little bit, yeah. you talk to him to save your money. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah, I remember that we'll from wait, the game we'll wait, now. Oh, wait, what? Yeah, we'll wait till we have, we'll wait till okay. we have a little bit more money to give to him. Though. Yeah, because we're basically... Or her? I don't know if it's him or her, honestly. Um, I mean, hey, when it becomes nighttime, we can find out. <laughs> All right, there we go. You got yeah. all the little boys. Yeah, we did. Now to take them to my dungeon. No, you're going to their dungeon. Oh, even better. You know, I like a little four-on-one sometimes. You're pretty good for a it's Danko script. Five kids. <laughs> oh, see, that's what I'm saying. See how they're racist if only yeah. human. Oh, yeah. Huh. <laughs> then I could give you an original Bomber's Notebook and make you a member. Wow. Then they're like, but nah. What do you guys think? <laughs> no way. No <laughs> That's funny. I get it's well. Not... Once, oh, okay. uh, yeah. <laughs> once we let some kid who wasn't he. Whoa! <laughs> I'm not gonna make a joke about that, but I'll teach you the code. It's just like I promised. I can only tell you once, though. What they're, saying, what they're saying is that they trusted Skull Kid and he betrayed them, so they're kind of iffy now. Ah. Uh... That sounds really. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Now they're gonna give you the code. One, two. If I remember correctly, wow, the code's just one, two, three, four, five. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it's two, four, two, five. Four, five. Three. I, I thought it was like based off the order that they turned around. No, no, no. It's two, four, five, one, three. Okay. Last time I played it, I remember it was it started with the five. Huh. I think. So I was saying it's always random. Okay. okay. So now what you need to do? Wait, but before that. Is... First, we're going to end off this episode right here, okay. and if you're excited for what Wannabe Reviewer was going to say, then make sure that you follow along. Cliffhanger on the first episode, that's how you get the views. But with that, I will see you in the next episode. Bye. Say goodbye, Wannabe. Bye-bye. I hate you.